thrilled to present our new high performance models. With these bikes, we are pushing the limits of what's possible and emphasizing our claim to design and innovation leadership in the motorcycle industry. With the new BMW S1000RR, we are once again setting a new benchmark among superbikes. It combines everything you expect from a real superbike. Whether on the racetrack or on the road, the RR is perfect for an extraordinary race and riding experience. The clear market leadership of our S1000RR in the global superbike segment is an impressive proof of its outstanding performance. And now coming to the new BMW M1000RR, the ultimate performance superbike. Born on a racetrack with its direct connection to professional motorsport, everything is based on the perfect interplay between dynamic performance, agility and precision. With even more power and an even sharper setup, the MRR embodies the entire M philosophy. Pure adrenaline and ultimate thrill on two wheels. This bike incorporates a lot of our world superbike know-how and our extremely successful motorsport season. Congratulations to Topak and the whole team to a historic world superbike season, winning the world championship title and proving that we are at the forefront of racing. Topak and Michael have had the opportunity to test these serial bikes and here are their impressions. The bike is absolutely stunning and the level of performance is crazy for a serial production bike. I cannot wait to see the design on 2025 World Superbike bikes. Thanks Marcos and the team for all the effort in motorsport. Here are the facts. Let's start with the new MRR. On the inside, over 20 changes were made in the engine to achieve a new maximum output of 218 horsepower, which is 3% or 6 horsepower more than the previous model. The changes include a new geometry of the cylinder head channels, bigger airbox, new butterflies, new geometry of the intake valve, new pistons, new clutch, new spark plugs and a new exhaust headers for more power and torque of more than 100 Nm from around 6000 till 15100 RPM. And the list goes on. In conclusion, the engine is developed for more maximum performance in the World Superbike. The second big change for the new MRR is in the mainframe, which is now optimized for stiffness and flexibility. For this, we have new engine mounting points, a weight reduced steering head and a modified back section of the mainframe. This makes the bike even more flickable on the racetrack, so you never miss an apex. The fairing features the third generation of the M winglets, which now produce a maximum downforce of 21 kg at 250 and 30 kg at 300 km per hour, generating more stability and keeping the front wheel longer on the tarmac. The MRR comes available in two variants. Light White Uni M Motorsport color and the M Competition package with carbon and forged parts in the Blackstorm Metallic. Coming to the iconic S1000 RR, it is faster and more competitive than ever. Most notably, the new fairing and M winglets derived from the previous M RR, now producing a downforce of 16 kg at 250 and 23.1 kg at 300 km per hour. For maximum braking performance, brake ducts have been integrated for better cooling of the M brakes. For more control, the M endurance seat can also be optional fitted in the M package. Now you get a standard all riding modes, including the Race Pro modes. The list of equipment has been extended even further with the M Quick Action Throttle. The new RR is available in three variants. Of course, the M package in light white Uni M Motorsport, Blue Stone Metallic for our style sport, and lastly, the well-known Blackstorm Metallic. <laughs>